Building and stirring are techniques used to prepare a variety of quick and easy cocktails. In this video, you will learn how to use the building and stirring techniques. By the end of this video, you should be able to select the basic tools and equipment needed to prepare build and stirred cocktails. Prepare cocktails using the building technique. Prepare cocktails using the stirring technique. Finish cocktails using the appropriate garnishes. Throughout this video, you will be exposed to the following employability skills. Numeracy, attention to detail, accuracy, neatness, efficiency. We will use the following tools and equipment. Rock glass, jigger, bar spoon, pre-pourer, ice scoop, straw. We will use the following ingredients. Ice, Campari, orange juice. We will garnish our cocktail with an orange slice or orange peel. A bill cocktail is the equivalent of a one-pot meal. Building a cocktail involves adding one ingredient after the other straight into the serving glass. When building a cocktail, ingredients are typically added over ice in this order. Liquor, modifiers, liqueurs, juices, and syrup, or soda. Let's take a look at how the building technique is used to prepare a screwdriver. Begin by placing your glass on the rail or serving surface. Using a scoop, fill the glass with ice cubes, about one to two scoops, depending on the glass size. Measure the liquor carefully using your jigger. Pour the content of the jigger into your glass. Fill or top up the content of the glass with orange juice. Add the garnish suitable for preparing this cocktail. Add your straw and serve. Let's review. The building technique involves adding one ingredient after the other straight into your serving glass. Ingredients are typically added over ice in this order. Liquor, modifiers, which are the liqueurs, juices and syrups, and sodas. Finish your cocktail with an appropriate garnish that complements your drink. Stirred cocktails are drinks such as martinis, manhattans, and gimlets. The stirring technique is used to chill clear spirits, liquor or liqueurs, when they are served straight up, without ice, or on the rocks with ice. This technique chills the drink to a suitable serving temperature with less dilution than the shaking technique. Let's take a look at how the stirring technique is used. First, place your rock glass on the rail or serving surface. Then, using a scoop, fill the glass with ice cubes. Measure the liquor carefully using your jigger. Pour the content from your jigger into the glass. Fill or top up the content in the glass with orange juice. Insert your bar spoon in the glass. Hold in the spoon with your thumb and first two fingers and ensuring the back of the spoon meets the base of the glass. In one direction, using your bar spoon and ensuring the balance is controlled with your fingers. Be careful to swirl with the back of the spoon facing the side of the glass. Not agitate the ice. Agitation will create air bubbles in the drink. Add a garnish suitable for the prepared cocktail and serve. The stirring technique is used to gently mix ingredients while dissolving enough ice to dilute the mix. Stir your drink with the back of the spoon facing the side of the glass. When stirring, use your fingers, not your wrist, to move the spoon and push the ice around the glass. 
Garnish your cocktail with an appropriate garnish that complements your drink. We have come to the end of this video. You should have learned how to select the basic tools and equipment needed to build and stir your cocktails. Prepare cocktails using the building technique. Prepare cocktails using the stirring technique. Finish cocktails using the appropriate garnishes. You were also exposed to the following employability skills. Numeracy, attention to detail, accuracy, neatness, efficiency. Thank you for watching this video on using the building and stirring techniques to prepare cocktails.